What's up, YouTube? So, I had a recent problem with my uh, MSI GT72 laptop. The uh, plus and equal key, basically the bracket broke. And the key popped off. This is the old bracket. So I got a new bracket from China for eight, for the value, the budget value of $8. But a um, uh, keyboard costs $88.00. And you'd have to open up the computer, which would void the warranty. So I didn't feel like going that route, so I paid the $8. So if you notice, the old one versus the new one, what happened here is I got a little brutal on it. The old one's to the left, and the new one's to the right. If you notice, let me get my screwdriver, because this is hard to point out. The little plastic tabs right here on the sides and the new one are not on the old one. Because I tried forcing it back on out of frustration and I broke the little tabs off. So I was not able to have my key again. And while pushing that little soft part, I don't know if you can see that, there's a little soft part to the button right there. That would basically still function as an equals and plus sign. You don't buy a $2,000 laptop to make it look like it's, you know, from the junkyard. So, anyways, what you want to do first is you want to make sure that you line up your... Uh, should we call it under key support uh, with the two big tabs on top and the other tabs are on this little part right here which you can't really see that well sorry about the focusing my camera's not the best but see the little two little tabs right there that's gonna go there so you got you got some patience with this so again you're gonna have the big tabs if I can get my fingers focused on on top and then this little part right here down here that's gonna hook in first sorry about the focusing Using a mini screwdriver might help. Okay, you just worry about the little ones first. If you're really delicate, you don't want to destroy anything. I oh, almost had one. So you probably can't see this, but I finally got that little piece of two prongs. And now you just have to get these side prongs into the top two metal pieces which you probably can't see either because it's going too much. But I'm gonna pause the uh, recording and do that and then uh, show you the next step. So you wanna use a screwdriver, by the way, right here, and carefully just apply them underneath the metal things. And then it should look like this. And the last step is to take your key, put it in the right way, and you just carefully push down and it's gonna snap on to the plastic bracket. Make sure you get all four clips. There's little clips underneath. I have an extra plus button to show you. And you see that there's one, oops, sorry. One, two, three, four, four clips. Just put the key in the right way, push down, and it works perfectly. And that's how you replace a key on your MSI GT. 72 keyboard. Hope this helps.